Ah. Oh, you better say Mimsies. Yeah, they are tasty. Mm, <laughs> nom nom. Rude. Hello everybody and welcome back to My Sims. I'm Blala and today we will be completing our very last level zero star sim. Uh, My Sim and that is Violet. Yes, we're going to complete Violet and then that's it. That will be all of the level zeros. And then in the next episode we can finally start on star level one. I'm really excited. So let's get straight to it. Let's get Violet sorted. Um, the very last towny sim at level zero. Do you know, I don't think there are any towny sims at level one. I think only commercial. So level one might be nice and fast. So Violet lives just across the way. Here she is. Mm, spooky. She is a spooky sim. Sister of Poppy, as we should all know by now. Uh, Nightshade. I think it's Violet Nightshade. Let's check out her pad. Creepy. Look at that. I quite like the purple, actually. Uh, these chairs are interesting, aren't they? These kitchen countertops. A little strange. They are kitchen countertops. They are really quite different, aren't they? Nice candle. Dead plant. Mm. <laughs> uh, oh. I didn't think she liked flowers. Lovely. <laughs> Not a lot going on. She doesn't have a sofa. That's worth pointing out. Or a fridge or, or anything like that. And oh, she does have a bed. Check out her bed. That is quite funky, isn't it? I like it. Nice little table. Oh no, Violet's having nightmares. I bet she was up all night having seances. That's probably why she's asleep in the day. Nothing in the bathroom. <gasps> Check out that wallpaper. I'm not sure if I would be able to relax in the bathtub with this shit on the wall, to be honest with you. Um, wherever you go, they follow you. Right, let's get out of there. I think this is supposed to be a bit scary, but I think it would just cheer me up. Uh, I like that. I think it's great. I think that's great. It, it makes me smile. Um, well, Violet, before we wake her up, actually, shall we find out a little bit more about Violet? Uh, we have met her before. We got into a bit of a fight. But we made up. Violet, here we go then. So, Violet thinks the prettiest flowers are dead ones. Unfortunately, her sister Poppy disagrees. Hanging around Poppy's super cute flower shop may test Violet's patience. But it still beats her last job, kitten photographer. So, she obviously like spooky i think that much we've gathered um but she's also into fun now i didn't see that one coming she doesn't scream fun go getting social kind of lass but apparently she is and she doesn't like cute that does make sense so there we go that is violet now we need to make her something to get best friends become become best friends Mm, I think, I think we're very limited. We are very limited. Um, I'm thinking, I don't know. I'm thinking, hmm. Well, we could go fridge. But then she doesn't have a table to eat at. Mind you, we could go fridge and sofa. Should we have a double whammy of excitement? So, oh, she's up. Oh, she went back to bed. Okay. So it's probably I probably woke her up, you know, snooping around her house. Right now, being that we are ignoring this star at the moment, at level one there is only one spooky essence that you can get your hands on, unless, like me, uh, you do bump into Cassandra. You can uh, get some ghosts. Oh yes, and of course, if you kill trees, dead wood. Brilliant. Oh, and the sad essences are also spooky. So, obviously I was lying, you can get quite a few. Um, but at the back of your house, there is a spooky tree kicking about. Look at this. Uh, ooh. Okay. I forgot about that face that's on it. Uh, I'm not sure I like this. 
Now, spooky trees. This is a thorn one. I think you can collect a few, some seeds of a few different spooky trees, which we will, I'm sure, find. And then we might keep this a nice spooky section. We might plant some other variants here. Now, what's great about these is... Um, these are technically already dead trees, so how they grow thorns is a <laughs> complete mystery. But if I was to chop this down, it would be... Let's do it. Shh, dead wood. It is dead wood. So let's stomp this out. Now, plant thorn. Chop a tree down, plant one in its place. I've told you this, people. So let's drown it. So, it's dead, but it still grows, still requires water. Very interesting concept. Uh, la 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 la. <coughs> it's going to take a while, isn't it? Should we take a stroll around the place? Patrick's house? Yo, Patrick. Empty house next door to Patrick. Okay. Remember this? Blossom trees, apple trees, all the tasty stuff. Prospecting. Let's do a bit of prospecting. We've not done that in a while. Oh. <coughs> oh. Oh. What have we got? Better be awesome. Magic A balls. Everyone loves balls. Come on. Come on. Be gold. Stone. <laughs> yeah. There is no gold here, just to clarify. You probably already knew that. Ooh, there's one. I know there's one more here that we need to find. Stone again, which is apparently studious. Oh, oh, oh! Magic eight balls again. They're fun, so technically she likes magic eight balls, doesn't she? So we could. Because I think they give the colour black, so we could we could put that into some... Oh, and the purple crayon for cute. Yeah, so we've got some magic eight balls. Actually, might come in handy. Might come in handy. Let's go and see if that thorn tree is all grown up. Uh, no. Come along. Mmm. Soak it up. Grow big and strong and dead. Anybody about? Anybody hanging about in town centre that we can play with while we wait? No. Still not a lot of sims in town, is there? Let's be honest. No. All the people we started with, plus Chef Gino. Oh, next episode... We're going to go in there, we're going to see what it's like and have a whale of a time making his enormous lists of things. I just, I seem to... Oh, hello Patrick. How are you? Are you? Always eating. Always eating. I can't be with you Patrick when you're stuffing your face. It's disgusting. Let's go back. Oh, thorns! Yes! It's interesting, look, it's gone bad. But presumably, if we were to chop it down when it's dead, like <laughs> my Sims version of dead, I presume it would still just give dead wood. What is the point of making this tree go bad? I don't know. I suppose it's less thorn essences, I guess. I suppose. How many have we got the buggers? Let's let's check. So in Spooky, we've actually got a nice selection, given that we're ignoring anything at level 1, although I don't know if any star level 1 stuff off the top of my head. I know we get some geeky, but do we get any Spooky from level 1 unlocks of essences? Don't think so. So, all things considered, this is a nice little selection. We've got tons of dead wood, look. So, we should be able to make a couple of nice bits and bobs. So, workshop. Create new item, please. Um, 
I actually can't make the rounded refrigerator at the moment, don't have all the parts. Although that doesn't matter I suppose, we are going to customise it, so I might as well just stick with a basic refrigerator for the moment. Two blocks <laughs> is that refrigerator, not getting a lot on that are we? Two blocks, look. Yeah, jobs are good and uh, it's a bit crap isn't it? We have to change this up a bit. Which is fine, but ultimately the question is how? How can we change this up? We could... Look, this is how crazy this thing is. We can make it. All you have to do is cover the stars, remember? So if we do this... Look how weird this ridge would be. Oh god. God damn it! It's just <gasps> done. Look at that! Ah. <laughs> you can see the stuff they have in it. Mm -mm -mm, that looks nice. That definitely needs to be grilled right now. Oh, I'm hungry just looking at it with some eggs. Oh god, a gammon steak with fried eggs. Mm. Yes. So we think that's probably milk, some ketchup. I'm not sure I'd want those. Corn on the cob. This could be any number of leafy green. Not an artichoke. No, not a cauliflower I don't think. Hard to know. So, that's ridiculous. I want to build with some of these essences because look, these thorn ones, these thorn ones, <laughs> yes. Yes. Get, get up, get up, get up, get up. Let's turn this one. Yeah. Look at it. See, this is what it's all about, right here. <laughs> mm. Okay. Now, 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 now. Let's see, we can have... Oh God. Determined. Uh, I just, you just go too far away now. <gasps> yes. Get under that. Do it! Do it! Do it now! Okay. Is that... Oh, is it the same size that goes in... Oh, it is. Okay. Or we could change it up a bit. Get rid of this shit. What we could do... What we could do... Is... Mmm. Yes. Do you see? Do you see? People. There. Funky. It's a little bit weird. <laughs> But it's got must have a butt ton of blocks on it. Let's have a look. Thirty nine, brilliant. This alone will probably best friend her. Let's paint it. Oh, we've got so many options. So we've got ooh, checking out the ghost. Okay, okay. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Thorns. Oh, do you know I quite like that flowery one. Might decorate her bedroom in that. Uh, sad, mm, rain clouds, no. Deadwood? Ah, mm. Now, she likes fun as well, so we've got eight balls, which has got the black on it. I do think we should take full advantage of the black. We've only got six of them though. And clownfish, it just doesn't scream violet, does it? <laughs> Don't think we'll be using those. I don't like the door. Oof. Okay, well, look, I don't love it, but I'm sure she will. Look at all this. It's spooky on it. 59 spooky. 
the ten percent tasty will be just because it's a fridge, I suppose. Well, this alone will probably best friend her. Let's give it a whirl. Let's give it a whirl. That probably will do. And oh, it's night time. Well, actually, she's probably up at this time, isn't she? So. This is one of those rare circumstances where I'm probably quite happy to go to her house at night because she's probably more likely to be awake and alert. There she is, see? She's looking bored. Tinji hmm. Bisselfrib. Vidanga? Mm hmm. Ah, uh, it's good to be here in Blarmania. I like to find a dark, quiet corner to relax. To relax in when my kid sister gets overwhelming. Yes. I'm just, sorry. I was just thinking, where are we going to put this fridge? I quite like these candles here. And she's made herself like a bit of a living space with these chairs. But it's all going to have to change. Yes. Now, while we're here, let's check out the decoratives. Uh... Oh, Bella! That's what that picture is. It's called Bella. So that is supposed to be Bella Goth. We do have one. Okay. Uh, Angry Tiki. Angry Tiki. Angry Tiki. Can we go? Oh, you're just not having it, are you? Angry Tiki. Uh, if you're not bothered, it goes. Uh, we've got the, uh, the Asian mask. We have this. The carriage lantern would probably be quite nice outside, wouldn't it? I don't care about that either. Let's get rid of it then. Oh, a Chinese mask. Oh, she likes it. Lovely. Um, oh, and she has these dark red windows. So she has... This doesn't care. Okay. She has some different windows. Dead flowers. She has those in her kitchen. We know she likes those. Anyway, she's got some. A happy Tiki. I can't see her being overwhelmed or enamoured with this either. No. This is goths for you. Indifferent about everything. Haunted house column. She's already got some of those kicking about. What's this? Haunted house picture. Oh, I've seen that somewhere. I'm sure we've seen that somewhere. We have, haven't we? She's got this. Oh, God. Or was it in Patrick's house? might have been in Patrick's house, you know. Might have been. Oh, this is a nightmare to use. <laughs> she likes it. It's staying. Uh, what else have we got? All kinds of stuff. Sad bear. Sad bear. This should be a... Oh, she likes it. We'll keep sad bear then. What's this? Sad tree painting. Do we have a sad tree painting? I don't think we do. I think this is new also. So we'll put this. <laughs> it's getting crowded. Indeed it is. Well, we could probably reduce... Oh, because she's got some of those candly masky things over there. I think what we might do is pull them out of the kitchen. I know, I know. And I... Oh, and she does have that painting. Let's get rid of that. Sorry, sorry, Violet. But there's no point in having repeats. Salon screen. Oh, that's quite good. You probably not asked about this though, right, Violet? No, so we won't have it. I quite like it though. What's this? Scary statue. Oh, we don't have. I don't think we have a scary statue. Woohoo! Woo <laughs> She's digging it. Then these are the the Zoe's green candle and Zoe's red candle. So we've got those. And Zoe's voodoo stuff. She could do with a bigger coffee table for that stuff. Voodoo stuff. She's bound to like that. Yes. <laughs> yes. So, fridge. Right? Let's give her this amazingly cool, awesome fridge we built. <laughs> it's not that good, is it? Sorry, Violet. It's the best we could do. Times are limited, but you will be a permanent resident on of our perfect town. It seems to not take up a lot of space. Looks really out of scale, doesn't it? Oh, she she does like it, which is 
which is the important thing, isn't it? It does look a bit all wrong. But it's okay, because Violet will indeed, definitely, 100% be in our perfect town. Which means that um, we'll be making her house all lovely. We will see this house complete and stunning one day. Oh, and I mentioned about being able to paint with essences. I've never actually shown anybody how to do it. Um, but we saw... Oh, I seriously used up all the thorns. <laughs> oh no, I used them all up. So we can't... But there we go. So you can... You can paint with them um, not only the walls but the floors and the skirting boards yeah and we can also do I think oh no can't do the windows well screw you but don't overreact nobody likes a whinger so we'll leave it like that for now you hate us now don't you but come on Spooky's off the scale. Done. Balala, you've been very kind. Maybe I'll create a whole bouquet of dead flowers for you sometime. Yeah, that's great. Lovely. Violet has given you a new flower stand blueprint. Poppy will be so jelly. Well, <laughs> we're celebrating. Look at this. Way. Woohoo! Best friends! I thought you liked dead flowers. Contradiction. Oh, we got some. Got some scary. Got some scary. We could have put those into her. <laughs> More scary. Okay, is it because it's like night time? I wonder why she's dropping those. So, this is probably the flower stand we've got, right? This is probably it here. I just got like a scary face and hands and it's like a, a monster of some description i suppose we better go and check it out guys let's go check it out it's night time as well blah blah all sleepy she's had a very busy day towny sims are nice and quick uh to to get done it it has to be said so let's check out the blueprint and then i think we'll call this episode here So, blueprints then. So, flower stand, flower stand designer. We've got here flower stand totem. So, that is what we got from Violet today for best friending her. Fantastic. Wonderful stuff. Oh, we're doing great. Come on then, Blala. Time for bed. Yes. Yes, it is. I want no whinging. And you get away with brushing your teeth this time. But it's only because we don't have a sink. So, that is it. That is Violet. And not only is it Violet, but it's also all level zero sims completed. Way! So we can finally move on to star level one sims. Uh, starting with Chef Gino. Cannot wait. It's going to be great fun. He's going to give us so much crap to do. It will probably be a long episode. Lots of heavy editing to try and keep the time down. <laughs> but there you are. This is the pains of trying to get a sim to one episode. Some end up quite long. Some end up being quite short. Whatever happens, I always try to keep it around the 30 minute mark. But we'll see how it goes. I know he's got a lot of stuff lined up for us. So very exciting. I will see you next time with Chef Gino. Bye.